Hello, welcome back. We are going to read a new story and it's called Terrible, Awful, Horrible Manners and it's written by Beth Beckerham and it's illustrated by Richard Watson. Terrible, Awful, Horrible Manners. Do you have good manners? I bet you do. Let's see what's wrong with his manners. You want to? Burp. Terrible, horrible, awful manners. Okay. Did he just belch? He did, didn't he? Okay. And I'm seeing dirty handprints all over the wall. Once there was a boy named Pete who had terrible, awful, horrible manners. There he is with his mama. He burped everywhere. Burp! He tooted a lot. Toot, toot, toot! He picked his nose. He didn't wash his hands. He talked with his mouth full. Those are all not polite things to do, aren't they? And worst of all, he never said thank you, or please, or you're welcome, ever. Not even to his grandma. At least you got to use good manners around grandma. That's just necessary. Pete had terrible, awful, horrible manners. Burp, burp, toot, toot. But he didn't care. He thought it was funny. He made people look at him and Pete enjoyed the extra attention. Toot! Then, one night at dinner, Pete noticed that something strange was going on. Hmm. Mama winked at Daddy. What do you think's going on? His dad was burping. Burp! A lot. Every bite. Burp. You keep burping, but you haven't said excuse me, Pete said. Hmm. Is that part of Daddy's plan? Could be. His mom tooted loudly, although the mill, all through the mill. P.U. Tooting is rude, Pete said. Toot. The baby picked her nose. Maybe she didn't know any better, but nobody stopped her or told her it was gross. Ooh! Mom, Dad, baby keeps picking her nose, Pete reported, but no one said a word. What are they trying to do, do you think? Do you think they're up to something? It was a strange dinner time. Nobody said thank you or please or you're welcome. Everyone kept burping and talking with their mouths full. Burp, slurp, <laughs> toot, burp, toot, slurp, chomp. Dad even started eating with his hands. Ooh, looks like he needs a napkin. Finally, Pete had had, had had enough. How come everybody's acting so weird, he asked. I don't know what you mean, Mom said as she wiped her nose on her sleeve. Yeah, Dad said, we're just acting like you do. Pete looked at himself. His hands were dirty. There was food all over his clothes, and he was pretty sure he had just tooted. Maybe I should try to use better manners, he said. Finally, Dad said. Thank goodness, Mom said. The baby just smiled.
Well then, Mom said, let's eat. Give me those veggies, Pete yelled. Mom and Dad and the baby all looked at him with surprise. Please, Pete added quietly with a smile. After that, Pete tried very hard to use his manners. Well, most of the time. Toot! Is that a good way to teach? He knew the manners he was supposed to use. He just didn't use them. Is that a good way of teaching someone? Give him an example? That's right. All right. Thank you for listening to us today. Have a great day. Bye.